Hi, it's me, Roger, doing another update. Anyway, hunting season's wrapped up. I've just finished my hunt here at Trinity River National Wildlife Refuge. And one of the things I've been kind of holding off doing a review on was kind of um, my uh, Summit Titan SD climbing stand. Uh, I've used it all season, and I've been holding off doing a review on it because I wanted to make sure it was really what I liked. And after doing all season, I wanted to kind of show you some things I like and didn't like about it. But uh, anyway, overall, here's the stand. I, I got this stand because I'm a large guy. I'm 6'4", um, 265. Let's just call it that. And the weight rating on this stand is 350. Um, it's the largest stand I could find. Biggest platform, closed top stuff like that so um this is the first climbing stand i've ever used and i have to say i'm pleasantly pleased with it uh, large platform easy to climb i was really skeptical of being a big guy and stuff like that but um show a couple things on here this cable um i really like i like the connection method how you can adjust it and stuff like that um really large platform I mean, for a big guy, you can get up and stand up and uh, have your little circle of your movement and stuff like that. Uh, the one thing, I, I do like the climbing part, the foot part, but these are just chintzy. These plastic things, while a good meaning, but um, they're just chintzy. I like how you can adjust them back and forth, but I've seen some other stands that have a more substantial thing right here to put your foot in and stuff like that. Um, upper part... Man, I don't think you're going to find a more comfortable seat. This thing has got every kind of adjustment imaginable. You can adjust the back of it, the front of it. Uh, this back cushion really helps. I mean, this right here is one of the most comfortable stands I've sit in. I mean, I've primarily come from ground blinds and stuff like that, but I can sit from hours on end. As long as I've got some coffee and snacks, I'm fine. Things I didn't like about it was this back doesn't really have any kind of cushioning on it. So when you put your seat back here, you wind up um, going into this crossbar. So I wrapped it with some pipe insulation. I went ahead and wrapped the top with pipe insulation. It comes with these kind of just zip on things that go right here, but I didn't like them. They spun them around. So I took two of them, uh, put them on the front of this all the way around. That way it really kind of padded the whole front end of it pipe insulation on this side pipe insulation on this side um let me get over here um i got my pull rope for my gun stuff like that it's got a little connecting cord from the top and the bottom which kind of stretches i kind of like that so anyway um i really do enjoy the stand i mean um i've it Coming from a ground blind, I can see where, you know, getting up 15 or 20 foot really helps. I mean, I climbed this tree right here up to about where that top branch was right there. That's about where my head was. As um, long as you get some nice hooks to screw into the tree, to put your bow, your gun, you know, your pack and stuff like that, I don't think you're going to have any problems with it. It's got a really good strap here to... to uh, connect the top and stuff like that. So anyway uh, Summit stands a plus on this man um, And if any of you big guys are ever really out there considering wanting to get a climber um, Summit Titan SD I, I highly recommend it coming from a big guy. All right. Thanks for tuning in. God bless. Bye